Welcome back, everyone. I'm Nick Lefebvre, coming to you again live from the shadow of the Gerald R. Ford Presidential Museum in downtown Grand Rapids for Art Prize. And I am now joined by a couple of artists, Rick Luke and Tiffany Marie, whose piece, The Seeker and the King, can be found just outside of the Bob, also here in downtown Grand Rapids. Guys, thanks for joining us. And congratulations, because they found out yesterday they're in the top 25 of pieces for visitor engagement. That's got to be pretty exciting. Oh, yeah, we were very excited when we got the news yesterday. Well, good. Well, first question for you, for people who have not yet had a chance to see your piece, give us a little explainer. Uh, what kind of work is it and what went into making it? It's concrete sculpting art, and the amount of work that went into it is probably endless. We are 14, 15 hours in a day until we completed the project. It took us about four and a half weeks, which is typically an eight week project to do. Um, the weight of the project weighs between 8,000 and... Probably eight to 10,000 pounds. Yep, <laughs> so it's uh, very heavy, it won't blow over. Yeah. And, and that's what we do, we just sculpt concrete into whatever all right, so for people who have not yet seen the piece, uh, uh, what sort of message are you trying to send with it? What's the story behind it? The story behind this one is there's a pelican who was born a fisherman. She didn't really want to be a fisherman like her family and family before her and didn't know what to do. And her family said, go figure out who you want to be. She runs into the woods, runs into this big gorilla, which is in front of the bob, and he's playing and laughing and keeps eating these herbs, if you will, and she couldn't figure out why he was doing that and amidst all of that decided she was going to paint him and once she painted him realized that's what she wants to be as a painter or an artist but she needs to take her muse back with her to show to her family to start something with this gorilla and the gorilla wouldn't come and then finally she convinced the gorilla we'll bring all your herbs with us in this crate which you'll see in the carving and we will i'll show you to my family so she brings her to the bob mm. she brings him to the bob the king and sets him in front and she's painting him um, to put their business card together and create a business. So it's that's entrepreneur. Right? <laughs> that is, that's fantastic. Um, now, obviously, you're in the top 25. What sort yeah. of feedback have you guys received from people who are coming around and looking? Well, a lot of people are like, how did you get it here? That's a good uh, question. Good question. It's, a, it's a piece that's, you know, 13 feet tall and close to 10,000 pounds. So that's one of the main things. And, and you get up close, there's just so much to discover. Uh, in the piece, uh, there's a lot of detail in the little frog, and you know, there's things you can see on camera, but all of a sudden you come close and you see all the, all the fine details. Beautiful project. We got about 30 seconds left. Describe to me this is not your first time at Art Prize. The, the difference is this time as opposed to your last time around, which was it three years ago, the last Art Prize? 2019, 16? Yeah. 19. So, what the difference is this time around? Well, this time um, you get to vote or award, give an award to different artists in this first segment of the competition, which is allowing a lot of interaction with the audience and with the artist itself. And everyone seems to appear to get something for it. Um, so we feel like it's a little fair. To yeah, and I think they've had some challenges with it, but people are learning and they'll probably refine the process and learn yeah. a lot from it. But I think it's hard to reinvent the wheel. Well, we're glad you guys are here. We are hope you're here again in the future. Rick Luke, Tiffany Marie, The Seeker and the King, you can find it outside of the Bob. Go and check it out. Thank you again, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Our art prize coverage continues at 5.30. We're going to be speaking more about the pieces that are in the top 25 and when we will know who wins the grand prize. Plus, Michael's going to be back with a full look at the forecast coming up.